we must continue. Attempting to find the rooms that are secrets. God, it's such a cool introduction to every level. We're on level three, if you missed the first couple of levels. You don't actually have to have watched them, like, this probably stands on its own. You just want to jump in here, but also it's pretty cool. Make sure to like the video for secret rooms, and subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2. Uh-oh, back to the lab again. So we back in the lab, got our beakers swinging from side to side. Okay, so snowballs might have something to do with things. Spyglass, just in case you can't zoom and you're playing this in vanilla. Holy frick, we got a lot of iron. Oh my god, we got a lot of copper. Oh my god, what are we gonna have to make here? Name tags, iron bars, chains. Our goal, once again, if you choose to accept it, is that we must access five secret rooms here that we have to find somehow. I doubt these buttons do anything. What is in here? It's a vroom vroom. Doesn't look like the George GT, but maybe the George GT will be somewhere. Those look like sliders. Oh, we got testificates. Yo, they're even called testificates. That's a throwback. Oh, wow. Would you look at this place? Very fancy looking. Retribution, six months, two days before my birthday. Happy almost birthday. Sydney Heist, four years. Happy anniversary, very cool. Let's just get a look-ski around this place and see what we have going on here because man, oh man, it do be looking cool. Hep, 100% approved. Did, did you mean HOA 100% approved? Because this place is pretty cool. I feel like it would... It would be able to pass some HOA guidelines. I think mo I, I don't think we have anything that's inherently floating. I think it's all, you know, secured to walls. Wow, it's a mecha suit? Is it powered by a testificate or it's completely automated? Hold on, let me check. Let me check up there. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, yeah, there's a testificate in there. Very cool. We're not up to full AI robots yet, I suppose. God, there is just a an absolutely overwhelming amount of stuff <laughs> for us to tend to here. Oh my God, how am I possibly gonna figure out what little things out of this entire place contribute to us getting into a secret room? Can I, uh, can I flip this? Can't flip it, no can do. Oh, we got an alley over there, wait. Hey, buddy. What's his name? Victor... Victor Cor Cortale. Victor Cortale. Well, you're very cool, Victor Cortale. Um, what's that a play on? Can I actually, like, move on this thing? That'd be sick. Anyway, I wonder if Victor helps us with one of the secret rooms. I have to imagine that... Victor helps us out here, but I don't know how Victor helps us out with stuff. Right, let's look. Okay, there's. I bet you. I bet you there has got to be something inside of the cafeteria. There's some secret room in here. Can I? Oh, I can get the Faboa balance. No way! A relic recovered from ruins of Roxamar with seemingly mystical, mystical powers. Testificates are still studying its properties. No way the Faboa balance is here. This is quite a throwback. Absolutely crazy. Barozi's sink for the love of Pringles. Please stop touching. Do not touch Barozi's sink. Thank you for your cooperation. <laughs> I should have listened. This is my fault. I have no one to blame but myself. So anyway, uh, Shekels, thank you for the sub. Angry Squid, 23 months. Zorok, 45 months. And Sior Nicholas, 37 months. Very cool. Do you have anything that we can enchant? Anything in there? No, can't do that. Dang it. Um, hmm. I just know that there's got to be something in the kitchen, right? Anything in here? No. Anything in here? No. Just turn on the watch. Oh, this is how we get levels! Okay, so. Well, that's good. What is it that we have to rename? 
And do I have, okay, so I don't have an arrow, and I don't think this thing doesn't have infinity on it to be able to do stuff. I'm gonna have to, oh, God, we have so many barrels up here. Urine, dream, paper. I wonder if we're gonna have to rename a paper for whatever the combination is. Okay, lots of pots. I'm just pulling random stuff into my inventory that's just, oh, that, that doesn't actually do anything, does it? Does any of this stuff do anything? Wait, does it have infinity? It does have infinity. Okay, okay, are we gonna, are we gonna be doing some sussy sand up in here, maybe? Mojo 2K3, thank you for the sub. Very appreciated, very cool. Wet floor. You don't seem to be doing much sweeping. Get back to work. Unbelievable, don't be lazy. Okay, I'm looking around. Sussy sand, can I break any of this? I mean, to be fair, I don't think it says can break on anything, so whatever it can actually break. We're gonna just have to discover it. Can I, wait, what is this? Synthetic clock, a clock synthesized to mimic a B00 original. You'll have to forgive me, I don't actually know the reference here, but I'm sure that you guys will know the reference because you know these kinds of things. Uh, there are three empty glass bottles, to be fair. Do I really need to crunch the turtle eggs? I can't crunch the turtle eggs. It's really good that you put these precautions in place. Thank freaking goodness, I almost crushed the turtle eggs when Mr. Man Turtle did 31 months of resubbing. Can you imagine if I had crushed the turtle eggs when Mr. Man Turtle had just done that? That would have been pretty bad. That would have been pretty bad. Hey, do we think we can give ourselves any, uh... No, we can't, because it doesn't actually have a platform that it's on that's valid, valid, viable. How about you? Do you? No. How disappointing. None of you are actually proper beacons. Do these guys not know what they're doing? Mr. Man Turtle says just do it. And Brosius says that you can, in fact, crush the turtle eggs. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Okay. Well, the turtle is telling me to do it. I can't... Di oh, God. Oh. Oh. Look what you could get if you just break turtle eggs. Okay, so, um, I, I tell you. I tell you, what we're probably doing here, if I had to guess, is we're gonna brew a potion. We're gonna brew a potion. Now, I don't know what kind of potion we're gonna brew. There are already several potions here, so it's probably not one of those. But I don't know what. Do we have, okay, we have a water bottle there. Do I have the, I don't know if I have the ability to fill up the things. Do we have a cauldron anywhere that's got some Wawa in it? No. Howard, thanks for four months. Very appreciated. Very cool. You didn't have anything. Oh, look at all those bottles of hex pee that I could just grab straight out of there instead of having to go take a shower. Oh, man, dude. I didn't go up here, though. Hold on. There might be some... Just kidding. There's nothing for me there. Uh, okay, to be fair, didn't go into this part. Didn't realize it was accessible. Good God, this place has so many areas. What am I going to do? Okay. Beep, boop. I'm beeping and I'm booping. I've turned everything on. Surely that's uh, how we access a secret room, is beeping and booping. Oh, it really is, hold on. That lever turns the fan on. Huh, not really getting blown back very much, but that's kind of cool. It's moving so fast that you can't actually see it spinning. Um, but I safely managed to get through because I am very acrobatic with my movements. Yeah, that's what they're doing. They're performing aero tests on a Formula One vehicle here. The the BAC Mono, even. What Brosia said, wait, is that the Mono? <laughs> oh, no way, no way, huh? Wow, that's pretty cool, huh? That's pretty, that's pretty cool. Hop in. Um, custom bot seat print. Uh, oh 
my god. Wow. It's so comfortable. That's so cool. <laughs> There have got to be some people who are going to play this map with no backstory, no idea, and they're going to be so confused, or they're just going to miss things and not and and not have any idea. But they might just be incredibly confused. This is like a very accurate driving perspective as well. Uh, Waddle DD, thank you for the three months. Brother driving, yes, I am driving. What do you mean build? It's already in the SDMP. I don't need to build it in the SDMP. I already have it. <laughs> Look at the powered by Spark. Oh my God. Oh my God. Powered by Spark Industries. Wow. Guys, imagine this. Imagine this with the flo flotato. Oh my god, imagine that with the flotato. How cool that would be. Very VIP worthy. Sure, we can do this. How do I do this? Uh, wait a minute. There we go. It has been done. All right. I've, I've accomplished nothing in terms of the actual mission of the map here at all. I've accomplished nothing. I need to actually find the secret rooms, and God, I have no idea. Hold on. We got... Wait. Are these, like, electrical circuits? We just have a bunch of electrical circuits inside of the shulker boxes. I don't think... I think if I took this stuff, that we would have a problem. I probably, oh, that's probably what I'm supposed to do. Okay, I have to name someone something specific. That's what it is. Is it, is it Victor Court Alley? Do I have to, na do I have to rename you? What could I rename in order to, it's like, A, I have to figure out what to rename, and B, I have to figure out what to rename it to. And I, I don't know. I do not, I do not know. Oh man. Wait, did I open this one? That was probably a good one to open. So Charles Shovel, scientists are unable to figure out why this oddity keeps appearing. Uh, what can it break though? So bro, I have so many tools and no idea what to do with them at all. Do I have a way to get on the catwalk as I do my little turn on the catwalk? Would taking this out of there do anything? No, just a normal... To be fair, there's a lot of things in a lot of pots, so I can't imagine that really has to do with any of the secret rooms, hopefully. I hadn't even been in here before. Oh, man. Wait, have I even been in there? Is there a way to get... No, that's also new. God, there's so many places on this level. It's crazy. What's in there? Paper. Oh, book and quill. This could be of importance, perhaps. Okay, running tests, taking coffee break, looking for customers, bringing a new test subject, running tests on Wanderer. No likes. No one likes him anyway. It was a spy zine. No, it actually wasn't, surprisingly. What about in here? Oh, this is the way to get into here. Holy frick, we're zapping. Oh, my God. This is like Zine's dream come true. Zapping wandering traders with frickin' laser beams and stuff. And then... Whatever that man's doing in there, I don't know. I wonder if there's anything... I wonder if there's a secret room to do with... This. Let me in! Oh, he's mad. Uh, can I get in? I guess it's already occupado. Hmm. Well, you just get to, you just get to stew there for, oh, I punched him. What about Creeper Leone? Oh my God. It just doesn't end. Wait, I want to, is there a way that I can? How come no one likes my trades? Wait, do I do it again? Please don't, I have trades. 
How did I wander into this mess? <laughs> oh my god, wait, what does this one do? Nothing. Please don't! <laughs> I can give trade information, just stop! The Enderman, the Enderman, why can't you just shoot at the Enderman? I swear I had no dealings with Creeper Leone. Okay, fine, I believe you. But unfortunately, I don't know how to pivot this freaking laser beam, so... Man, he's really mad over there. Um... Anything over here, by the way? It looks to be a little alcove sort of deal. Hmm. Do that. Turns it on. Does this go through anything? I feel like I need a... I need a minecart over here. Maybe that's one of the secret rooms, is get a hold of a minecart. And then... After that... Can't punch Creeper Leone. Do I actually, like, want to do this? I don't know if this is a mistake. This guy has a lot of health. I was thinking because the Wandering Trader said shoot the Enderman that I'm like, okay, so we'll hit the Enderman. But man's got... More health than a warden, apparently. Good lord. Okay, that's not working very well. But yeah, maybe... That's not working either. Okay, maybe I shoot the minecart underneath him. Hmm. It's not helping. Ow? Ow? Why is this hurting me? Why can't I hit you? The frick is up with you, mate! I need to shoot him from a different spot, you think? Uh... What? Yeah, I don't... Ow! Why is that hurt? That was the sound of me unlocking a room somehow, even though I... Huh. Interesting. I got him. Yeah, I don't know how I was... I guess, you know, if he's stuck inside of the, uh, the minecart. I don't know why it... Why did it make a difference? The arrow phased through the Enderman and the blocks behind him. Oh, what the heck? Golden apple room. Room to grow. Huh. You know what would be really interesting to do on the SDMP? Would be to make a room like this and use picture frames. But you, oh, you can't put it on the ground though. That's the problem. The ground would be, the ground would be an issue because you can't put them flat. They've got to be on walls. Ah, kind of kills the process. Kind of ruins the process, but whoa! Fancy. I'm not going to have any room in my inventory for all the things cuz this does this work? Oh wait, you can now eat the You want me to eat the apple? You really want me to eat the apple? Fine. Brosius has joined the game. Did you just, did you eat the apple? You know that you need that to win, right? I don't even know if I should give you another. You'll probably just end up eating it again, whether out of spite or just to see if I coded a different message for the second time, which he didn't if it's anything like the other time. Well, I'll save you the suspense and reveal I didn't. The code exists because of someone like you. Isn't that enough validation? All right, here you go. Get on with it. You have secrets to reveal, and this was not one of them. How could you be mad at me for doing the very thing that you told me to? This is so mean. DJHT, thank you for the sub. Randy, for every 18 months, finally caught up on SD and PP. Can't wait to watch the next one live. Let's go, dude. Pretty swick and help me IDK. 46 months. So we got one. 
Oh god, there's another there's a second layer up th up there. I I probably have to get to. Holy frick. I feel like this is not going to do anything. It's not going to do anything. And if I get like cuz there's target blocks kind of everywhere. Oh. Makes noise. Cute. Still don't think that really does anything for us. Um Hmm. Maybe there is something to do with a target block somewhere around, but it's like a specific one. And not just all of them. Hmm. Can you shoot the testificates? Negative. Bounces off of them. That's very spooky. Big, big hunking chunk of uranium. Dang, bro. I'm so sorry, everybody, but, but I'm gonna have to hint. Anvils take damage. After enough uses. Huh. Interesting. Interesting. Frick. Heckman. Heckman. Ah, uh, balls. Wowee. So it wasn't about who to rename, what to rename them, anything like that. It was merely just do. Player wins losses. Wait, Cap wins three, two losses. I'm in the lead! Brosy. Oh, wait, maybe I'm not in the... Oh, Fabrizio is actually in the lead. Unless these are different games, but Fabrizio is crushing it. God dang it. What the frick? Oh. Wait, what is this? Okay. Location. Something. Health. 30. Item, item. I don't even know what we're grading. What are we grading here? Oh, wait. 130 health. 30 health. Honey block. Slime block. Where's my diamond? Or is there like... Is this a secondary... Wait. Sparkles. Rare. Explorer type. George GT. You may instead deal 0 HP damage to rev up. Are these... Oh, these are Jordimon cards. Oh, I see. Got it. These are my attacks and stuff. That's awesome, Jordimon cards. Next time Georgie T deals damage, deal an additional plus 80. Yo, Mighty Elf 200 bits. Hello, Cap. I hope you enjoyed the monthly compliments. Absolutely. Hey, it's the diamond. Wow, look at the, look at all these Jordimon cards. Location, Twinkly Trash. Builder. What is this? Item. Oh, I see, dude. Man, yeah. Why does... Oh, no, but Bro... Brosy has 260 health. I have 290 health. And it's that's the remaining health that's left on the board. Man. Brosy does way more damage than me on both of these. 50 and 90 versus 30 and 70. Oof. I'm getting fricked up here with this. I'm weak. Total chaos. Rare. Location. Players flip a coin. If heads active... Oh, is this actually, like, taken from the Hermitcraft game? Is that an actual Hermitcraft one? Because it has Hermitcraft uh, language in it. Unless, unless Brozy wrote it down. Hmm. Location is Doc M's base. Ooh, got Hermitcraft, but you added some cards. Got it. Cool. Hermitcraft is not a game. It's a way of life. Wow, that's so cool. Wow, and you can even spectate. I tried to right-click to see if you could spectate. Ah, TCG. I missed that because, well, who looks up when playing video games? I mean, come on. Nobody does that. That would be 
just crazy. Okay. Well, next up on the list, I don't know. I bet there's something, uh, maybe not in here because there's already something. There's obviously something in the mono room and I don't know where else I'd, I'd expect for sure. Yo, I should get a helmet. Let me, or, and boots. Let me, can I yoink? I can yoink, bro. Let's be safe on the job. We gotta wear the hard hats. Gotta wear the hard boots. All right, all right. Okay, there's something in. Something in the mono arrow testing facility room. But what would it be? And where would it be? I may have to hit. I'm so terribly sorry, but honestly, we if I don't do hints, we might be here for 20 hours. So, don't give me the HOA thumbs down for this. Allays drop items off of the player or at a recently played note. Oh, the freaking note block in the alley. Oh, man, I knew something was going to have to do with Victor Quarterly. But I would not, I don't think I, I actually don't think I ever would have made the connection. I don't think I actually ever would have made the connection. But what? Is it any item? Is it simply the lead? Um, okay. All right, Victor Cor Cortale. Bring it to the place. Oh shoot, it needs to be, uh, I guess two of any, anything, right? I guess anything. Hey, uh, come down. Come down, please. Come down. I'm begging you, please come down. Come back. Please come back. Uh, here's an item. Come, come here. I, uh, come on down. Oh, he's coming down. He's coming down. No, he's not coming down. He's coming. Hey, 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 hey. hey. I got, I got this. Hey, come here. Uh, I, w I realized I was supposed to do the item first. Yeah, I, I haven't used alleys in a, in a bit, admittedly, um, which is my mistake. But uh, hey, Victor, Victor, Victor. There's no other note blocks around here, are there? Mm, nothing else I can lure him away for. That was my, my boo boo. He seems to be kind of chilling there and not wanting to move. There is a second alley, huh? Oh, hey, wait a minute. There's another note block. How do I power that, though? I guess just punch it. There we go. Hey. Hey, there we go. And then and then do the one up there. Wait, where is he? Did he grab it? Did he grab it? He's trying to go the he's trying to go the other one. Wait. Okay. Hey man. Grab it. Grab it and then go there. No. Grab it. Bring it to the note block. Bring it to the note block. Bring it to the note block. Do it. Yes. No. He's supposed to drop it in the hopper. Go up. Yes. My man. He did it. Let's go. Oh, it's, oh, wow. That is a very, very big door. Holy frick. Emerald room. Sanctuary of chains. Wow. Is that an octopus? The emerald octopus. Very fancy. Wow. It's like tractor beaming the stuff. Oh, you're following me. Yeah, you can follow me around. That's that's cool. We're chilling, dude. We're chilling. Although, are you going to go all the way back to the note block? You don't need to. I know you have an expiration on the note block, though. So, actually, you're just going to follow me around. Let's go. I can't give him the emerald. If I give him the emerald, then I he's going to maybe just go flying away to the nearest note block, and I'm going to lose it, which will be so sad. Hmm. Trying to figure out, oh, it's like nether portals with a honey block. It's nether portals with a honey block spinning in opposite directions inside of each other. Do I, I, ah, god dang it. There is something I must do in this vicinity. But I don't know what that is. I can't activate the beacons. 
Um, I may hint the frick out of this again. Wouldn't that be cool if I hinted this again and then I'll be like, oh, that was so obvious, but it was something I would never have figured out. Hmm. Nether portal is a good hint, huh? Uh-huh. Okay. Yeah, I don't I don't know how to get in there though. That's the problem. It's kind of encased in glass. So like I don't know what you want me to do about that. Nether portal. Nether portal, huh? Mmm. Hmm. The uranium is shipped from Jerry's lab. That makes sense because green things. That's such an Easter egg, bro. That's the Easter eggiest Easter egg of all time. Who to thunk it? Wait, is that? I can't do that, right? I don't think I can. Yeah, no, that can't be buttoned with a bow. Things made out of stone. Lame. Yeah, Jerry is producing uranium in order to feed nuclear reactors, obviously. We're trying to get that sustainable power energy, okay? It's got... It's got good motivations behind it. Um, is there anything in the car? Anything in there? Geranium. That's a flower, man. Flower man is Goku. Everything becomes everything else. Is there anything in these, by the way? I guess there wouldn't be. What time is it? Six, 16, I guess. Okay. I yeah 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 yeah. So I might I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna. I'm so sorry, everybody. So what do we need? Nether star. Players think through powdered snow and able to climb out unless. Oh, unless. Well, where's the powdered snow? I don't think I've seen any yet, or at least I haven't noticed it. Um. Maybe I haven't noticed it because I walked on top of it without realizing. Well, yeah, 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 you were said you said I was wearing a thing and I thought that meant that I had to take it off. Hmm. Yeah, that's that's interesting. Okay, okay, crazy idea. Like what if there was something where like shooting an entity through the portal takes it into somewhere else? And then that See, I don't need to use hints for everything. Sometimes I get it right with no hintage. Four out of five. That's like 20% done completely myself. Huh? The cart will not return if you're not in it. Don't be stupid. Okay, I'll try not to be stupid. It can be difficult sometimes, but I did find this on my own, so I think that counts for something. Other than I left Victor behind, which is a little bit sad. That's my Mogus. That's my Mogus, and this is electrical. Would you look at that? We gotta do, we go, okay, we're wiring, we're wiring. Mm, that right there is a four out of five, four out of five. And then, um, hold on, just gonna head into the vent. He's venting, he's venting. <laughs> Victor, I swear I'm not a bad guy. Victor, where where's Victor? Oh god, did my co oh no, did my co imposter just Oh poor Oh Oh Victor, you're okay! Oh, I was so worried. Thank goodness. Bro, there's oh there's vents everywhere. Oh my god. There's so much sus to go around. Man, this should be the new Mogus map. Why don't they why don't they make Mogus 3D and and set it here? That would be really cool. Wait. Hey. Alley son. Yo, we found the other alley. Hey Victor, have you ever considered saying hello to Alley son? Should I free Allison? I'm going to I'm going to free you to fly around the factory. There you go. Take it. 
Take it! It's yours! You can... Take it! I guess I need to hand it to you first. I remember how allies work. Um... <laughs> Come here! You are free! Just because I gave you an iron bar doesn't mean you need to stay trapped in, in prison. Go! Get it! No! Pick it up! I carumba. Come on! Okay, okay. Good, good, good. Let's go, let's go. Get on at it. There we go. Now we're cooking. Good job, guys. Good job. You're gonna help me find the powdered snow now, right? Perfect. Now we've got six eyes is better than two in terms of finding the pow pow snow. Oh my god, it's right there. It's right there. I wasn't expecting it to be on the wall. Oh my god. It's on the wall. Okay, so hold on. Wait, how do I do this? Wait. Oh, it opens that way? Um... How do I get up there to be able to... Is it is it about just throwing the boots in? Or is... Hold on. Is it on the... Oh, the other side is available, too. No? Wait, the other side is not available. Uh... Wait a minute. Oh, my God. This is crazy. Okay. Wait. How do I... Oh, wait, wait, wait. I see. I get it now. I... Get it now. Hold on. Oh, uh, let's go. We're swimming up powdered snow. Hey, wait, this is the first time that we're not doing some sort of like, uh, whatchamacallit. You know what? I think I've just gotten so accustomed uh, on this. Whoa. I think I've gotten so accustomed on this map that everything is like about triggering um, observer blocks. And as such, I forgot that maybe there's actually just secret room accesses that, that we can go into. Oh, this, is this Genshin again? Oh my God. Genshin Impact loading screen. <laughs> I am the only person who has not played this out of everybody who is here. Guys, could that be my, my future? You know, after I retire Minecraft from the main channel, um, do I become a Genshin Impact YouTuber? A Gamba YouTuber? <laughs> No, don't do it. Do it. No, no, please. <laughs> so, you know what? Maybe I actually have to look for it. Yeah, this was just unexpected. You know, I feel like maybe I would have thought about the powdered snow thing before if I wasn't just so one track minded on just doing activate uh, observers in order for a secret door to open. Okay, now that we're back in the like, okay, maybe some of the secret rooms will actually be, you know, like a, like a, a thing I have to go into myself, like a secret entrance that doesn't get redstone activated. Um, okay, on to the next one. Let's look at that fancy, fancy thing. Fancy animation, oh my God. It's trembling, earthquake. Holy frick, that's crazy. How does he do it? Look at all those flotators propelling the blocks into our view. Wow. Didn't I say something was happening in 20 minutes? Did I? I don't know. I'll probably be in this level in 20 minutes trying to figure it out. 80% of the 25 doors are redstone. I see. Oh, hello, Bartholomew of the Mausoleum. Wow. Okay, we're stuck in here. We're stuck in here. Very cool. What did I say was happening in 20 minutes? 
Oh, yeah, it took me 20 minutes to do the first puzzle. I didn't say something was happening in 20 minutes. I'm like, wait, what is happening in 20 minutes? You guys are... You guys are gonna have to tell me my schedule because I don't know what's happening in 20 minutes other than me playing this map. Can I pick Jar, holding bodily relics of the king? Wow, can I grab the gold? We thought you had to find all the all the rooms in 20 min- Oh! Yeah, no, that's absolutely not it. The gold-lined blade, a weapon buried with the king. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness gracious. Can we, can we retrieve anything out of the pots? No. Do I grab the jars for the king? Is this the king from Fallen Kingdom? Is this the kingdom has fallen and now this is where he was buried? It went very Egyptian, which was not expected, but here we are. Oh, wow. Man. It'd be kind of, we could spice up some uh, Sands of Time MCC for the next season with with this stuff. It'd be pretty cool. Okay, there's something to do with this. If there's not holy misdirection, why would you do that? There, no, nothing, balls. God dang it. I like the color palette though, dude. I really, I really do. Imagine being able to build things that look like this. Imagine being able to do that. Imagine how cool, how swick, how awesome. I wonder if there's something to do with that statue even, perhaps. Okay, we have another another area on this side, obviously, with more cool stuff. So we're going to have a thing in here, a thing in the main room, thing in the other room, and then two extras in certain places. Hmm, what is it that we must do? We must, I wonder if we have to assemble a, that sounded violent. Do we have to assemble like any sort of specific thing? Sticky poo, be able to make an arrow, perhaps. Do we have a bow activated thing? Any other archeological stuff? Okay, so I could make a pot out of that if we can find a crafting table. But I don't know if we have any crafting tables in here. There might not be. Okay. Hmm. Oh yes. Wait a minute. Can we make? Can we make a sussy brushy? We might be able to make a sussy brushy. Possibly. Is there any? Ooh. You know what? Sussy sand being the trigger for something would be cool. This looks like it would be an opening for something. Hmm. We might have to hunt for some sussy sand. I have a feeling. God, it's not gonna stand out very much against all of the other sand stuff that's in here. That's gonna be difficult. If I were a sussy sand, where would I go? Okay, this must be something, right? We have, we have four floating sand pieces and it's snowing sand there's got to be like we are supposed to get these to drop somehow now i i don't know how but oh no i'll take that back thank you i don't know how but there definitely is a thing that we okay so that's definitely one thing how do we activate it though nobody knows and that's being uncooperative <sighs> frick yeah, no floating sand is allowed as per the HOA. Thou shalt not float. So we're going to have to brush a sussy sand. You know what? The other option is that the sussy sand is near the crafting table because we do have to craft the brush. So that could be... Ooh, got another... Okay. Embalming ointment. Bottles of embalming ointment left behind for the pharaoh. Oh, that's so cool that there's infinite ones of them. Huh. You just keep clicking and you get more and more and more. That's pretty cool. So we're going to need to do something in an anvil, clearly. Um, I'm going to... Hmm. Hmm. What am I going to do? What am I going to do with that? If you throw, if you throw um, that stuff onto floating sand, will it update its gravity? 
That I don't know. You saying why it give infinite sounds like a sounds like a teacher asking, you know, rhetorical questions to one of their students. So yeah. So why did I give you this homework assignment? Why did I? You're on to something, kiddo. You're thinking the right way. Now elaborate on that. Hmm. Didn't want me to do that, huh? That's fair. I was curious, though. Just had to... Just had to find out. If only we had infinite stake. God, if only, man. That's all I want. I'm gonna need to explorate forever, probably, to find infinite stake. But I'm... I'll do it eventually, dude. I'll do it... I'll, I'll load new chunks and... Crash the server, if need be. Um, I'm pretty sure that I got... All these apparent chests, but there might be other... Oh, wait a minute. Mummy bath water, no effects. Please don't drink this. Oh, there's also infinite mummy bath water. Huh. Okay. So two chests with infinite bottles of stuff. That was, um, that was expensive. That was very expensive, what I just... Dropped on my face there. Okay, cool. We had to replace the one. Um, hmm. Man. Like, I know I'm on to some things, right? There's going to be something I have to do with levels. There's going to be something that I have to do with the bath water. Uh, or maybe those are both the same. I'm going to have to brush a sussy sand. And there's going to be something to do with a sword. Like, I have so many things. What about... Frick. What about... Damn it, really? You don't update with that? Heck. None of you are sus, right? No. Um. Frick. Frick. You know what? That is. Mm. Ooh, I think we do this. And that's why there are four mummy bath waters, is that we can use them to extinguish four. Although. Maybe we want to do it here. I'm just going to extinguish every campfire so that there's no more lights anywhere to be found. Who needs light? Not me. That's what my mom would always say when I was doing any homework. She'd be like, how can you see you don't have any light on? And I'd be like, I don't know. My eyes work. They, they see the things. Um, oh, that sand is on barriers. Oh, I see. So what you're telling me is don't waste my time doing, trying to get those down. All right. Well, thank you for, uh, saving me pain and suffering because I would have hyper focused on that. Okay. Not that. All right. Which campfires I'm, am I really just like harming the viewer's ability to see things right now by putting all these campfires out? Is that actually just completely unnecessary? Hmm. Okay. What the balls? And got it. Any other campfires around here? that we can remove from play. Are there any in here? Maybe it's just remove every campfire. And that way my my mom, oh, maybe it's these, because these are special campfires. And they're blue for the blue mummy bath water. This is just balls. What are we doing here? Why is this not doing what I need it to? Why are- I put out every campfire. What do you want from me? Holy frick. I totally overlooked this. In the- Okay. Uh, there we go. Thank you. Adventurer's Research Notes. Research Notebook. During the exploration of the Azarik Mausoleum by archaeologist Jibrail. I can't believe my luck. Or perhaps my studies finally paid off. I successfully located the entrance of this temple buried by the sands with my trusty steed and flame bow in hand. I will find all the secrets this place has to offer. I can't believe my luck. 
Perhaps skipping all those survival training days is finally coming back to bite me. My brush broke while dusting off some pottery, and I have no means to repair it. Well, don't worry, I'll find a crafting table, maybe. The ones with the glyphs on them are highly suspect. They must mean something. I can't believe my luck, or perhaps my observational prowess has blessed me for once. I spotted an oddity in the statue room and will go investigate. May my heart weigh light and my luck be heavy. Okay. I also kind of wonder if Bartholomew has anything to do with anything. Hmm. Hmm. Bartholomewing. I, I learned that the term mewing is like trying to strengthen your jaw by like flexing your, or strengthen your jawline by flexing your tongue or something like that. Um, Bartholomew, are you storing anything? No, you're not storing anything. Dang. Just a saddle. I could steal the saddle from Bartholomew, possibly. Bartholomewing. Why is there no crafting table? This is so messed up. Um, also a great way to get a lockjaw. What? What do you mean? You get a lockjaw by just trying to flex your jaw muscle for increased jawlineification? I thought you only got lockjaw if you got tetanus bacteria. I don't think you can just create tetanus bacteria infection by pushing your tongue under the roof of your mouth. But what do I know? Not much. Not a doctor. So, okay, we got sus. Sus sand to find somewhere once I can get the brush back. And then something to do with water bottles. God dang it. I'm like, we're, we're tip of my tongue for several things. But I just don't know what. Arrows on the ground point to groups of candles? They do? What do you mean? Okay, there's no way that it's like put out the candles. There's no way that it's that. Why did you reset me? I did not go off the edge. What? That didn't hit? What the frick? Bro, that was like when you, when a car that has the, damn it. That was like when a car that has the safety features auto breaks you when you're going around a corner. Cause it's like, oh no, the road, it is ending because there's like a guardrail as the road curves. I'm going to break so that you don't hit the guardrail. And you're like, holy frick, no. Stop being an idiot. I can see. I have eyes. That's why I'm driving. Stop braking automatically for me. Your car doesn't do that. That's, I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad. Cara's Tesla does that sometimes. And also. That was fancy. So the blue was the key, and the arrows. That was so smart for that suggestion. Very smart, also very cool bridge. Wow, holy frick, what a fancy bridge that was. I also, I had an old, I had an old car that uh, that also did that, and it was just utterly obnoxious because I used to live on a like very, very windy, narrow road, and there was a particular spot where every single time that I would be driving. It would auto break me every single time. And oh, it was the most infuriating, obnoxious thing. Oh, I can get the bow? A bow uh, used extensively and with great care. If not for the fate of its owner, it would still be in pristine condition. Oh, that's the guy whose journal we read. Jabrail, that's Jabrail, oof. Jabrail has seen better days. That's much uh, unfortunate, oofies. All right, well, we got the diamond. That's very cool. Yeah, I extinguished all of those campfires when I 100% did not need to do so. How cool. It's now darker. Wow, is that the sun streaming through? God's rays over there? We have another... Mm, maybe the falling sand in the other room doesn't mean anything. 
So hold on. That'd be weird, though. I feel like Jabrail's... Jabrail's bow can't have any bearing on other other rooms. Thus far, never has there been an item in one of the, like, rooms that allows... Like, you can get into any room on its own without having to go into any other previously. So... Okay. Yay. Okay. Cool, cool. Confirmed. It has no bearing on other rooms. Good, 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 good. It's just lore. Wow. Such cool lore, bro. Poor fellow. Hey, you know what? Maybe this was like hundreds of years ago that, that the book is there and he died of old age because it, it was just he's dedicated his entire life to the tomb, you know? So we back in the tomb got our research pen swinging from side to side of the journal and like he's just been documenting stuff about this place day in day out for 50 years it was his life's work and and old age he was like you know what i lived in the tomb i want to die in the tomb and it was actually a happy ending there's no saying that that jabrail actually had a bad time it might have been good might have been great um okay so let's see um what do we got what do we got so uh god i'm trying not to i meant to read this because i was trying to get the hints from here the not the the hints that don't count towards hints okay brush broke i have no means to repair it i need to repair i need to repair yeah <laughs> bartholomew yes you're right bartholomew would date this a little bit but bartholomew is immortal that's the logical explanation to what happened here is not that Jabrail met his untimely end due to horrific circumstance. It's that Bartholomew is immortal, which is also very sad because Bartholomew as a camel probably has no concept of immortality and is just waiting, wondering day in, day out where Jabrail is and why he was abandoned forevermore. That's unfortunate. Freaking heck. Hey, you know what? You can't be too hard on me because even, even, uh, uh, J um, what is his name? J Jabroni. Even Jabroni didn't find it. Um, he couldn't find this either. He did, like, so it's not that hard to <laughs> overlook. <laughs> Well, okay, so now we've got um, Jabrail, not Jabroni, right. Um, <laughs> now we've got this. So we've got to find the sussy sand, which you would think would be over here where, you know, the, the stuff was. You'd think it would be where we found the things uh, in the first place. But it is... Oh, frick me up. Okay, thank goodness. I thought I just disposed of it, which would have been most unfortunate. His name is now Jabroni, according to the lore. We've we've uh, retconned it. Um, M. Harrison with three months. Very much appreciated. Uh, okay. Hmm. We are planning to play the content warning game this weekend indeed it is being done or will be being done yes okay where the heck is the thing where is it how could i forget the thing that i i stated at the very beginning if i can find a crafting table i can assemble the pot and then i proceeded to find the crafting table and not assemble the pot like an absolute buffoon there we go okay and then oh wait a minute can i put these down somewhere is there a place that i can put these down by any chance i don't know if there is a place that i'm able to put these down do we think that maybe they can be placed down over where the brushing brushington is Oh my god. Is it you? Has it been you all along?
Oh, it's sussy underneath. Oh my god. Oh my oh wow, this is very fancy looking. Huh. This looks completely different than a pyramid. Huh. That was a very, very little tricky maneuver there. Hiding. Hiding the sussy sand underneath the pot so you can't possibly see it without assembling the pot so it gives you an indication. That is a lot of steps in the process. How did we go from ancient Egypt and then get into very, very different architecture? Incredibly different. Can we go in the house, by the way? I always do love the warp doors that look like a interesting guy with a flappy face and beard. Anyway, anything cool in here? Can I just live here for a bit, if you guys don't mind? Wait, this isn't Genshin again, is it? Someone just said, is this Genshin, and I'm scared now. This isn't Genshin. Is it? This is also Genshin. Hey, Brosiest, just a quick question. How much, how much have you spent on Genshin? Zero dollars, zero dollars, wow. This guy, impressive work. I mean, I don't actually know why it's impressive. All I know is I've just heard what I've heard while playing this map, but only your soul. <laughs> that sounds respectable. Is that respectable, guys, to be a to be a zero dollars spent player? Okay, so we've got two of them, and definitely no hints at all. I mean, we haven't used this, but yep, no hints from any source at all whatsoever. Um, okay, okay, so. What was the next thing from Jabroni? So, we got the pottery one, and then an oddity in the statue room. Is this the statue room? Which is the statue room? There are statues in every room, so that doesn't really narrow things down very much. Um... Do, do we think the statue is the Anubis room? So we've kind of done that one, unless there's a secondary thing. Because there's statue there, statue there. And I'm just saying, like, you could say any room is the statue. Okay, the other jabroni tip was for the candle. Cool. So it means that we're down to, what do we do with the sword? And these pots of king relics and stuff like that. Um, EAP Chunk, thank you for the sub, much appreciated. And Bobby St. Bob with three months, usually catch VODs. Happy to be here live. Thank you, happy to have you tuning in and stuff. Um, okay, if I were going to put a sword into something or use a sword to do something, there's got to be a secret room in, in the main room. There simply has to be. And there's another one over there. And then that would only leave one that's kind of doubling up because we got entrance, Anubis, here and there. Then there's gotta be one more. Hmm. You're right, it probably has sweeping edge for a reason, but what would, what could I do with that? If we're looking around for attack cursor activation, uh, This is, I can't, I can't do that. I don't think I can do that. Well, Bartholomew might be immortal in terms of like age, but I don't know if Bartholomew is immortal in terms of swords. But that's the thing, like, I don't know if this is, cause what might actually have to happen, like does Bartholomew need to get ridden to another room and then after that, you like, no, 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 Bartholomew, we go, we go, we move. 
Hmm. I have an idea. I have an important... Oh, wait. Hold on. I have an idea. This is how we get to Anubis. This is how we get to Anubis. Actually, wait. I could just go that way, but hold on. Um... Uh-oh. <laughs> Bartholomew has been TP'd to a safe location. <laughs> Please don't lead him into the pit. <laughs> oh, good. That's very exciting. Um, that is how you would get to Anubis, and that's how they spent 30 minutes doing it. God dang it, I thought I was smart! Wait, I just love seeing the camels do it in F5, though. Like, with their legs going Flappy Bird. Whee! Uh, hmm. Okay, I might need to read some amount of vintage. I bet Bartholomew does actually have to do with something. I just don't know what. So, uh, we've done two things, though. You know what? We've done two things. It's a later level, too. So... What were, what were, we got Gapple and we got Diamond, right? Or, so let's do Nether Star. Something to do with Sweeping Edge. Wow, what do you know? Knocks back entities in an AoE around the target at close range. Armor stands are quite versatile in this regard. No kidding! It's almost like I'd be looking around for an armor stand, except the only ones I know are the ones that have been holding the items like the sword to begin with. God dang it! Hmm. Yep, doesn't doesn't help at all. If I knew where the sweeping edge thing was, I would have already hit it. I feel like that doesn't Can we can we uh get rid of can we uh bring that tips consulted back down to 9 because it gave me information I already knew and it it didn't help. So Oh, wait, is there something up here? Hold up. God, I got so excited there for a second. You put a chest up in a secret location, and it gives nothing? Thank you, Brosiest. I've been told that I am an honorary minus one to my tips consulted. I want you all to note this for the video. Okay, question. Can I use Bartholomew to... No. Bartholomew. Um, get me up here. Buddy. No! Bartholomew, I need to get up here. Okay? Mother trucker, dude. Mother trucker. Hold on. Balls. He takes so long to recover. Okay. No! I can definitely get up here for sure. I just know it. Frick! Okay, maybe if I jump and then shift dismount. Oh, come on! Okay, maybe I have to do it backwards. Oh, but no, then he launches forward. That's not gonna work. Um, okay, here we go. And Velian, thank you for the two months. Much appreciated. And Daitoku, 500 bits. Been watching you for a while. Loved all the videos. Miss all the modded survival series. Much love, Jardoon. Well, come on down to youtube.com slash Captain Sparkles 2. We got modded series for days. Let me tell you. Frick. Just face sideways? It's not working! It's not working! Frick. Okay, so I jump, and then turn sideways. Oh my god, dang it, man. Taking damage from this. Okay, so I dismount. Whatever I do, I dismount to this side. It doesn't matter where I start. Frick! And I'm only doing this because I see a path up. I see a path up. That's why I'm freaking... Ah! There probably is an easier way up here, and I'm, I'm tunnel visioning something absolutely stupid that is unnecessary and dumb. Um, oh, wait a minute. Is that a way? Hold on. Oh, wait. Hold on. Uh, that might be a way to do it. Mm, that may be a way to do it. Hold on. Oh, I'm not getting up there. Wait, 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 wait. Can you go? Can you go up? Can you go? 
Can you go up there? Frick! Hold on. Let me just check. So we do have... Okay, we do have these trapdoors. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, maybe I have a way. Maybe I didn't need to... Maybe I'm really... Hmm, wait. Oh, frick. Hold on. Damn it! Um... Hmm... Yeah, the camel really, he's not a fan of jumping. He's very much not. Like, can I do, may, mm, I don't think I can do that because I'm gonna hit my head there. Uh, I don't think I can work that anyway. Let's see, okay, maybe over here is the way. Perhaps over here, wait. No, that's not gonna work either. Frick? Oh, you have the trap doors aligned differently. Well, now I see what's up. Uh-huh. Wait a minute. Oh, I can't do that, though. Mm. Shoot. Shoot. Is there a way to do that? Can I... Can I... Wait. How would this be done? Balls, that's not the way. I like, would I jump up and then flip it? Frick! I might have to do a jump and then flip. Something like that, see if it works. God dang it! This is a tricky one, I've gotta get the, gotta get the controls chip. Okay, freaking ding dong. I gotta get the clickies just right. Gotta get the best clickies. Mm. Tricky clickies. I'm trying to figure it out. I just heard rats, which would be very bad. Ah! Man! Gotta be kidding me. This is so crazy. Okay. Ooh, wee! Okay, does this even help? This honestly might not have even helped me in like any way, shape, or form. I guess, oh wait, I can go up. Yeah, yeah, there we go. <gasps> I applaud the effort to make it here. I regret it was for not. By the way, it's not how you spell not, as in English, not. That would be, it's like, are not. In physics class, are not is not A-R-E-N-O-T. <laughs> Probably didn't fit on the sign. That's fair. Okay, now I need to upgrade the map with spell check. <laughs> Why have you done this to me? Ah! Bartholomew, he's coming, he's coming, I whistled. Here we go, the clutch. <gasps> oh, he gets it, Bartholomew in with the alley-oop, let's go, okay. Could probably get higher on the boat, yeah, I don't think I will. No, thank you. Okay, do we think the armor stand is just like, whack the stuff that was holding things? Maybe just have to whack the stuff that was previously like, holding the, you know? That's not working. All right, so we know it's not on the boat. We've narrowed that down, thankfully. So you just gotta run around swinging at everything that we see, everything that moves or doesn't move. Well, not everything that moves because then Bartholomew moves would get hit and that would be very, very quite sad. Would you rather have an immortal snail chasing you or an immortal camel. The camel would be faster probably, but it would be very easy to spot. So, you know? He's wearing armor. What the frick is wearing armor, huh? This golden lapis, the 
trying to hit the things with gold and lapis. There's a lot of gold and lapis around here. But I'm not seeing the armor stand. You'd rather have the camel? Because it will die of exhaustion? What do you mean? We're talking about the immortal camel. He's not going to die of exhaustion. He's going to come at you forever, relentlessly, never stopping. Your grandma doesn't love my content? The frick, dude. I've never been so offended in my entire life. Jeez, bro. Have you tried your cat, though? I've heard cats love my content. You should introduce your cat. A lot of people do, and their cats seem to be very satisfied. Yeah, what's your grandma's Twitch account name so I can ban her? My god, I don't know where this thing is. Oh my god, I'm so oblivious, but also, that really doesn't look like... Hey, you know how I would have seen this easier? If I hadn't extinguished the campfires. Okay, well this is not doing anything. Is there anything on the other side? By any chance? Oh, there are ones on the other side. Let's try those. Oh! What? Oh my god. Bye-bye, Bartholomew! Whoa, whoa. Shattering of the duet. Dang, what are we... F is this... Are we flotator-powered right now? This is crazy. Oh my god. We're flotatoring through a rip in space-time. Man. That's wild. Okay, so where is the nether star? Here. I don't actually know where the nether star is. That's the, uh, that's the next quest. Figure out where the frick the nether star is. If I were to jump... Oh, God, the nether star is over here. Oh, wait. Or is it? Oh, no. It is not. Wait. It is. What the frick? Oh my god. It's Rainbow Road, except more ominous and, like, gravity void and frick. Oh my god, this is crazy. Hold on. This is like... This could be... This could be thumbnailable, even. You know, this could be like... This could be a secret room in the, in the fabric of space-time, bro. Okay, anyway. Oh, there's the nether star, by the way. Whoa, and then this, like, takes me out, probably. Dang. Crazy. Took, we take a few screenshots here. And where am I going to end up? Boop. I'm in a dark abyss. I'm going to launch. Whee! That was a very fancy way to return. Hey, Bartholomew. I bet you were wondering where I went and you missed me, right? Right? Okay, so, um, something to do. So we have something to do with these and something to do with the, the bottles. What are these gonna be? Nobody knows. So, Wait, we gotta take Bartholomew back to the main room. We can't leave him behind. Hello, buddy. Hello, buddy. Let's go and figure out what the frick's cooking in the main room. I really am not a huge fan of the fact that the whole campfire thing did come back to bite me because it did genuinely make it harder to spot that. I feel like a big dingus. Okay, so what do we have here? We have a bunch of woodage. Bunch of woodage. We have the crafting table. We have the lapis. We have the beans. Don't know if that means anything. Bartholomew, are you uh, are you aware of other stuff around here? There's pressure plates. Can we set off pressure plates with these? No. 
I don't even, have we seen an anvil anywhere around here? I mean, we've already done anvil-related things, so... Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know what it is that we are supposed to do with this, nor the king's remains. Um... Let's think. I don't I don't think there's anything back in the Anubis room. I just don't. I could just to be fair, I could just put something on every pressure plate. Let's turn them all on. Let's see what happens. I also couldn't imagine it was gonna be that easy to figure out the opening to this one, because that seemed like a pretty elementary trick and we're a little bit more advanced here but I don't know I just wish Bartholomew was the key hmm I mean this is probably his this is his sarcophagus right this whole this whole big thing I wonder if there's a thing that we got it like we throw some XP into the into the thing maybe it'll open Sesame. Yeah. Oh yeah, there are anvils up there. I feel like those are just decoration. I I don't know that I can actually get up there in order to use them. And even if I could get up there, what would I actually use the levels for? Like, I don't I don't know. Yeah, we're thinking the mushroom block is looking out of place. Did you know if you feed mushroom blocks experience, they open doors? It's a little known Minecraft fact. This one doesn't feel like doing it though. It's kind of resistant to its nature, which is really messed up actually, come to think about it. Um, the frick is up with the mushroom block. I don't have any tools to do it. I mean, the sword's done. We've done the sword thing. Can I climb you? No. Do I throw something at you, too? Maybe the O's are like a target. And if you hit both of them in a certain amount of time, you win all the stuff. You win money. And by money, I mean the emerald. But... Hmm. I just saw the experience, like, came out from there. So there was, like, a place for it to chill at. There was actually a place for it to, like, chill up there, which is interesting. We're throwing from the pressure plate. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. What about, what about, is there something? There is something behind there. There is something behind there. Is it the whole thing or is it just those? Oh, it's every, okay. There is stuff there, but the question is, is it a parkour jump? Huh! I think that's an over three up or an over four up one, which means it's not possible. You know what? Is this Bartholomew's time to shine? He stands up. He knows. He knows it's time. Let's go, buddy. Let's go. Well, that's just fricked, man. Let's make it work, dude. Let's make it work. This is your moment. We've been at this for a long time. Come on. I'm going to be so stoked if this is not a redstone-related one, if it's just a actually just, just jump through kind of thing. Dang it, Bartholomew! Maybe I have to just get the jump trajectory perfect. I was in! I was in! What do you mean? Oh my god, what are we doing? I was in! Ah! Shoot. Shoot. No, I can do this. I can make this work. Frick. 
Does it work this way instead? Why does that work? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Why does that work? But he wouldn't let me off like two blocks lower over at the boat? I'm sorry, but that doesn't make any sense. Emerald room. Birthday dinner at the... The Deadly Diner. Wow. We're at... We're at Dine at Night. Oh my god. Nutrigrain bar. It's the finest. Definitely a diamond gift to a friend. Wow, one of the five treasures. I can't believe we've found Dine at Night. That's so cool. How... Could Bartholomew do this to us? You watched all the VODs for so long. Did you get did you get every block of the of the hill correct? Okay, okay. Give to a friend because you're cutie pie. Aha. Give to a friend to make you grow things in life you wish you could achieve. To make you grow things in life you wish you could achieve. Um do you have blue eyes IRL? I don't. It's to increase your look in life. A gift to a friend to make you keep going all night. Uh, to make you more... Hmm. That's actually not... I, I did something so that I, I would not... I wanted the opposite of this, actually. I wanted the opposite of, of that. Um, and so I did do the opposite of that. Um, so anyway, uh, maybe it fixes what I did. Who says that what I did needs fixing? Maybe, maybe the fixing is exactly the, the thing that I wanted. Okay, cool. We got into a non redstone one. That's very exciting. So the final one, the final one is what and where? Cause now we've had one in there, one in here, one in there, one in there. There's four zones, but five rooms. Oh, man. I think we're gonna... I think we gotta hint it up here. This has been pretty good so far in terms of not hinting it up, though. So... Totem. Yeah, I mean... What's interesting is... What's interesting is, like, this is kind of how we figured this out, is with the experience, but that wasn't what it was for. Which is interesting. Which is very interesting. How do... What do you... What does that mean? Experience orbs path towards players even through blocks. It's really funny that I was actually onto it by throwing through there, but I don't know where else I would do it. Oh yeah, guys, I'm at, keep in mind, I'm at 10 tips consulted, not 11 tips. It's kind of like when YouTube did this bug back in 2010 and everyone's subscriber count went to, not everyone, but my subscriber count went to zero. Does that work? Nope. Okay. And, um, and then when they restored the subscriber counts, I had like 2,000 less subscribers than before the bug the day before. It is weird that it actually crashes on the painting. Um, hmm. Hmm. But anyway, uh, then after that day, I made this note in my channel bio. This was in... Yeah, it would have been 2010, I think. I made a note in my channel bio that was like, Hey guys, just so you know, the amount of subscribers that currently show on my channel are 2,000 less than I actually have. It's very important. It's very important. I was at like 20 something thousand subscribers at the time. And the fact that, you know, I was showing 10% less subscribers than I actually had was a, it was a big deal. I had to fix that. Had to make sure nobody thought that I had like 23,000 instead of 25,000. You know, it's kind of a big deal. Kind of a big deal. Okay. Where the frick do I throw these things in order to do stuff? My god. My goodness gracioso. This is the hint we've given is uh, you look look at 
So this, you're saying this is an arrow? Look at the arrow when you walk through the front room. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, wait. A minute. Wait. wait. Hold on. Wait, what the frick? Wait, hold on. What the? Huh? What in the world? Yeah, um... Yeah, no, I, I never in a million years would have ever... I didn't know that... I didn't know that experience orbs... Trip... They do trip pressure plates. Man, was that... Were those pressure plates being there, like, supposed to be a hint so you figure out, hey, by the way, XP orbs trip pressure plates, which I didn't even know. I didn't even realize that was a thing. Oh, my God. Yeah, that's some... Um, that's some next-level fanciness that I will certainly keep in mind. Because that could be useful for stuff. But, yeah, that's kind of that's kind of wild. Those pressure plates were just to help get a better color. They also trigger trip wires. Wow. Oh, wait. We've got the sub basement here. Hey, I know this place. I've been here a lot. There there is another world in which I would have no idea what this place is and everybody else would be like, "I know that we look look at the, the look at it." Yeah, I got to sneak. I got to sneak. I'm going so slowly though. So slow. So slow. R.I.P. See you later. Level one artifact. Oh, no. Taken out by the Ravager in... Wait, what's the... Which Ravager was this? God, I forgot the name. Do we have the... Do we have the, the deposit? Where's the key, Brosy? Where's the key, man? I don't see the key indicator here. How many runs did you have to watch in order to recreate this, by the way? <laughs> I've been... I've been in... I've been in here the entire time. This whole thing has been decked out. Always has been. You took the key. It was pretty. Several runs. Uh, Animal Lover, thank you for the 200 bits. Just want to say I subbed during the time that your notifications weren't going through, but that's okay. Started getting your streams again. Love, STMP. Reminds me of SMP Earth. Well, thank you, Animal Lover. Much appreciated. Okay, I don't actually need to shift it everywhere. Where's the totem at, by the way? Back here? Man, I didn't see this hazard before. Oh. Frozen in ice. Um, you're right. The compass is actually pointing to something. That's a good call. Wait. 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 Okay. So. So, I just want to say... Nobody in the world is going to know that if they have not played or watched Decked Out. Nobody in the world, like anyone who downloads this map is like, this should be interesting. They've like, they, if they've gotten to this part without reading all the hints, A, impressive. B, they read a hint, they get here and they're like, where's the totem? Oh, the compass did say to drop it. Oh, okay. Got it. I didn't realize. Okay, anyway, well, we made it. Back in decked out. Uh, Themu, thank you for the 37 months. Very much appreciated. And return to the lobby. All right. We're on to the final level. Let's vroom. Oh, this is going to be an... I feel like this is going to be such an epic cinematic here. Huh? Oh my god, the logo of the map becomes... Okay, uh, so this is a Genshin thing, isn't it? I feel like this is the thing that we saw in level 2 with the thing that was dangling. Is that a Genshin thing? It's not a Genshin thing? Oh, okay. 
I was thinking it was a Genshin thing that that thing drops down or I don't know. Anyway, oh, a reality somewhere. somewhere. Oh, yeah, I, I should have known this was coming because this is the screenshot that's on the uh, map download page. Oh, wow, that's some crazy looking reality distortion over there. What do we have in the mail? Nothing, actually. That's the best. You know what the best days are? Days where you don't get mail. God. Days with no mail are such peace. Such tranquility. Oh, we were expecting you, Mr. Sparkles, they say. No, no, we have to continue for you see. Episode one of this is called 10 Secret Rooms. Episode two will be 15 secret rooms. Ah, I can't go inside of Sir Flufox. Also, if you made any of the secrets outside, I'm going to be upset because outside has rain. So please tell me none of them are outside. You don't want to see me when I'm mad. Hello, kitty cats. Hello, kitty cats. You sleep in the bed to reset? I don't know. Oh, hello, we have this. Monologue of the Sinner. Tears fall in my heart as rain falls on the town. What is this torpor pervading my heart? Ah, the soft sound of rain on the ground and roofs for a listless heart. Ah, the sound of the rain. Tears fall without reason in this disheartened heart. What? Was there no treason? This grief's without reason, and the worst pain of all must be not to know why. Without love and without hate in my heart feels such pain. Okay, you really had to put focus on the rain, which makes it seem like it's an important part of this place, which I don't like, because rain can go frick itself. Rain is a disaster in video games. It is a disaster in real life. It causes all things, human-built structures to fail and collapse and incur massive pricey damage. And I don't like it. Never do rain. You know, honestly, another one of my... Well, that's actually really cool looking. Another one of the reasons why it would be nice to be a renter again is because as a renter, I won't care if it rains. There's no stress. If it leaks, whatever. Not not a big deal. It's a serious, serious thing. Um, don't just give up on yourself. Whenever you think, I want to do it, I want to change, that's where your starting line is. When you decide to lift your head and walk again, who has the right to stop you? Isn't that right? Blah. Isn't that right? Blah. Isn't that right? Blah. Hmm. Yeah, lift my head. Look up. Uh, it does say that this is, uh, this is... The barrels on this floor are decor. You know, that would be a good way to add storage into a home, though, is just do that. Hey, we have some stuff around here. Oh, I cannot open it. Hmm, that's sad. Too bad. So sad. None of them are openable. Thank you for the message of the barrels on the floor are decor, because otherwise I would have, and I'm sure other people did, try to open all of them. Monologue of a Sinner, Volume 3. Oh, I missed one. Short steps, deep breath, everything is all right. Chin up, I can't step into the spotlight. She said, I'm sad. Somehow, without any words, I just stood there searching for an answer. Why does it sound like a song? When this world is no more, the moon is all we'll see. I'll ask you to fly away with me. 
until the stars all fall down, they empty from the sky. But I don't mind if you're with me, then everything's all right. Why do my words always lose their meaning? What I feel, what I say, there's such a rip between them. He said, I can't really seem to read you. I just stood there, never know what I should do. When the world was no more, the moon was all I'd see. I asked you to fly away with me. The stars all fell down and empty from the sky. How could I not mind? You were there with me. Everything was all right. <laughs> Are these clues? Does this impact something? Does this have to do with a secret room? I don't know, man. Oh, that's probably good. A cue ball for the billiards. Oh, multiple cue balls for the billiards. How nice. Can I grab the disappearing pool cues? Maybe not. Uh, if if I say yes, will you read all the books? Okay. Balls. Surely if I throw balls everywhere, one of them will get absorbed into a hopper. Right? Hmm. Dang it! Frick. Um, that's freaky dicky. Hey, wait, if I go in here, can I... Just wondering if I get rid of the rain, which would be kind of cool. Okay, we'll, we'll do that. Hmm. I don't know if these are considered the pockets. And I'm scratching, but I'm trying to scratch. Anything there? Any way to get in places? Hmm. Hmm. Or break glass with the with the pool cue, like I did at the at the uh, elementary school friend's house. The story I have recounted on many occasions. <laughs> yeah, I could do that. Um, okay, upstairs, let's check it out. Surely there is one secret room that is just behind a painting, right? At the at the end of it all, on the final level, you just throw, yeah, here's a room behind a painting. Wouldn't that be great? That would be awesome. I would like it if you did that. Hello, kitty cat. Is this your kitty cat room and that's your kitty cat tree? Wow, this is so cool. Why are you scared of me, long cat? <laughs> Long cat, why are you so lengthy? I have nothing to tame you. Oh no! Don't leave long cat. Oh, long cat cannot escape. Good. Oh, thank goodness. I thought I thought it was bad. Wait, what is <gasps> Charles shovel? Man, it really gets around. What what do we use Charles shovel for last time? Can I tame the long cat with the shovel? I guess not. Oh god, we're outside again. What a disaster. Okay, here we go. Um, it's me! Oh my god, it's little me! Look at that! Look at little me! I'm so cute! Chibi Captain Sparkles! Super CHP, thank you for the 200 bits. Much appreciated. Did someone actually, like, make their Minecraft skin have this as a head such that it could be utilized in a map? Because if so, that's very epic. Um... Okay, onwards. You made me who I am today. I learned to fly because of you. I kept playing the cello because of you. You taught me many things. No, I can't teach you anything. You don't want to know, you don't know nor want to do. Maybe all you really wanted was for someone to be there. I know it's mesmerizing here, but you've been spending so much time with me and imagining what couldn't be. Don't you think you're forgetting what actually is and all that could be? Sometimes stepping out of this world we made is the only way to notice and appreciate all the beautiful things around you. I just... Don't want to be alone. There's a lot out there waiting for you. I can't promise it will always be good, but I know you won't find that uh, you won't find all that you need living only in these pages of ours. You brought me into this world, and I won't forget that. And while some things are meant to stay, some are only meant to carry you so far. Whatever comes, if it's something we do, it's something you could do. So, are you ready, kid? Aye, aye, Captain Sparkles. I don't know. I don't think I'm ready for it to end. I don't care what you are or aren't. You were my first real friend. Take care of yourself, all right? Hey, thank you for having been here, even when no one else was. Okay, mm I have no idea what any of this is, but Chibi Me is awesome. 
Um, right. Okay, there is a secret room in this room for sure. Why do all the books keep getting longer? And there are so many of them. Patient, trustful, smart, kind, forgiving, considerable, funny, honorable. Virtues alike all from one mouth about a person. Admirable characteristics many hope to achieve. Being subject of such praise is rare. And humble mind may think not of hearing it. However, the changes. Now, that changes when it is spoken by a loved one. Being favorable in the eyes of those who, uh, whose hand you put your heart in carries the weight of all you are. Your truth is muttered from they who truly know you. They love you for you. All these attributes are secondary, but now their love has withered. What changed? Virtues alike, once from one mouth, about you. Yet, now they care for you not. What did these praises mean? They knew you, yet turned their back. Does chasing such righteous dignities matter if such descriptors still hold weights in the eyes of the masses? The only variable left is you. They loved you for you. And with a lack of words to describe your individuality, they fell back on common tropes. But now they care for you not, if not the fault of the titles bestowed by the one who knew your heart, then all the shame falls on you. It's your fault. It's your fault. You. It's your fault. It's my fault. Okay. How these are not helping with any clues of any kind, unless I just have to find all the sinner books and then the sinner books unlock what I need to do. There's a hidden thing behind the fireplace. I just know that there's a thing behind the fireplace. There simply has to be a thing behind the fireplace. Hmm, but there's not. Yeah, Hackmit, bro. Um, there's gotta be. Maybe I. Bring! Hello? Wouldn't be that easy either. Man! I was thinking you'd just give us a nice, easy finale. Oh my god, there's another one! Volume 2! My time has run its course. There will be no second chances. If the sift is to separate the sinners, why do I find myself amongst their shadows? I've always been told there's always fish in the sea. Do not understand the sheer magnitude of those words. Is there really another needle in the haystack? Any chance has sunk into the same sea of hay? If I have resigned myself to fate, then why does my hand stay clenched? Oh, wait. That's a good point. Shovels. Campfire. No putting out campfires in this section. Not allowed. Okay, what do we have over here? Oh, God. Oh, man. How am I... This door is bolted shut? Open sesame mother trucker. There's probably something outside too, but does mm, a snowball a campfire do anything? I don't know if it does anything. Also, I feel like I'm supposed to do something with the pool. Cue ball. A cue ball, that's what I'll be in 10 years when I have no more hair. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's more in here though. Wow, a nice kitchen with the pots and pans. Hey! Suspicious bovine aptly named A. Mongoose. A reminder, don't drop rice bot down the shaft. Who is rice bot? Notes for the job. I wouldn't think there would be so many specifications while working here. I thought this would be a simple remote culinary job. My culinary school didn't prepare me for this. Wait at least four days before dropping rice pot down the dumb waiter as a prank gives time for those fools down there to let off steam. The cat's favorite lunch place is in the ballroom on the chest. Drain out the garlic pots, excess water. At the end of the day, Blue Chef over waters did it. Oh, what is it? Uh, find any reason not to help Red Chef with the prep. Watching him stress is quite enjoyable. Okay. Good good notes. Thank you for the notes. Man, if only I could light the candle, you'd have a happy birthday time in here. You got anything there? Anything here? Anything there? Nope. I need a freaking bowl or shears or something like that. Maybe bowl, shears, something. Yeah, that's definitely a hint book. 100%. No, for sure. I see that that's a hint book, but... Don't drop a rice bot down the shaft. Okay, so where's rice bot so I can drop him down the shaft? How did I just get an egg? Why did I just get an egg? I've just I've come into an egg. Uh, did that give me an egg? Did you give me an egg? 
Oh, you give me an egg. Ah. An egg and a dandelion. And a fish. Ah, I see. Ah. Okay. Well, I don't know what this does for us. No, the cow didn't lay the egg. Surprisingly. Surprisingly even. Um, frick. Okay, what about over here? Excuse me. We went into this already. Um, you know what? You know what? I have hatched a plan that merely requires a few fishies. I'm going to remove all these. And I am going to take them to the kitty cat. The, what was it that the kitty cat likes? It was, um, wait, notes for the job. The cat's, it's in the ballroom on the chest. Is this the ballroom here? Wait, did I even go? I didn't even go to that side yet. Hello, kitty. Hello, long cat. You are mine now. So the ballroom. Oh, I have to bring you somewhere, most likely. This is bolted shut too. Cats, it, the ballroom on the chest. So what is the ballroom in the ballroom on the chest? Okay, come hither, long cat. No. Where, uh, hello. Come to me, long kitty. Is this considered a ballroom? I don't know where the... Oh, you know what? It's pro You're right. It's probably the pool table room. Where has the cat gone? Where is the cat going? Bro, did the cat just become invisible? Hello? Cat? Oh, there he is. Please don't have died just now. Okay, good. Yeah, this seems ballroom-like. Come hither! Come hither, cat. Okay. Uh, chest. In the ballroom on the chest, maybe? Is this it? Come to here. He sat down. He sat down on his own. Okay. Long cat enjoys the chest. That now can't be opened. I did not know that feeding a cat could trigger things like that. Wow, okay, so this mansion has some fancy goings on. Goings on around it, I suppose. I recognize that face. It's a black and white version. Oh, hello, long cat. Have you joined me? The long cat it has joined me. He pulled it shut. You freak off. You can't be serious. You can't have actually locked the place where the freaking emerald is. There it is. Thank you. Scientist log. The machine is facing some problems, and it's not the fault of us researchers, all right, that much. How are we supposed to get the memory, the data interface working in this small of a space? This machine could shape the future, whether it's the future graphs of my own head or reality's own. We simply need more resources. I'll have a chat with the overseer of this project about securing a space for a laboratory. How I yearn for this to be done with. I don't say that because I'm fed up with anything in this situation, no. I'm merely excited for the fruits of the labor. Merely is spelled a little bit wrong, but that's not too big of a deal if you're doing a spell check update anyway for not the not. Maybe I'll use this to forget all this and give my life R and R. It won't matter, it's fake. It's okay. Not an English major, he's an engineer. It's fine, not a big deal. Alright, mm. so what do we have in here? Ah... Uh. Oh, calibrated skulk sensor. Clever. I forget about those because I don't use them. Um, because they're too fancy for me. Do I have all the sinners volumes? No. Okay, so why the frick is the door bolted shut? And how does that have some bearing on what we're doing here, long cat? 
We need volume four, huh? Oh, it's blocked off by an invisible scientist force field. What if I'm gonna end up coming back here again in order to get through this freaking bolted door shut thing? Um, all right. Follow me now, long cats. He did. He did do. He definitely followed me. Okay. Oh, I gotta get out of this rain. God, I'm gonna have to go all the way around the house in the rain. Why would you purposely make me suffer? Okay, nothing more over here. Meow, 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 meow. He's probably yelling at me. He's like, you idiot. I know exactly where all the secret rooms are. I've been in all of them. If you just listened to me and learned to speak cat like a true cultured scientist, I could lead you everywhere you need to go. I didn't finish the back of the base, but at least the tunnel bore is okay. Huh. Okay. The tunnel bore. Huh. Got it. Okay, so we can't get in there, huh? Can't get in there. You don't want me to get in there. Okay, thank freaking goodness I can depart the rain now. Anything in here? Hmm. I swear, with all the trapdoors that are around here, for one of the one of the trapdoors is an opening to something. It's going to be one single trapdoor somewhere in all the freaking rooms is going to lead to one thing. So, all right, freaking notes for the job. My God, where do I get rice bot? Where do I get it? Drain out the garlic pot's excess water. Red chef and blue chef. One chef, two chef, red chef, blue chef. Where is the garlic water? Where the frick is the garlic water? And where is the bowl that I can use in order to milk you for mushroom stew? Oh. It's right there. I'm an idiot. How did I not go into that barrel? All right, we got mushroom stew. Hello, long cat. Do you like mushroom stew? No, you just want to sit there. Okay. What do we do with mushroom stew? If I were to do something, that is a valuable chandelier right there, by the way. Very valuable chandelier. If I were to, mm, Mm, I could shear it, or alternatively, it could get struck by lightning. But either way, don't know. I don't know. Where the fr- Rice bot, you're hinting me, he's in the ballroom. What the frick is rice bot? Oh, are you rice bot? You're rice bot, because you have text on you that says rice bot. Well, how do I throw you down a chute? I need to figure out how I throw him down a chute. Uh, hold on. Notes for the job. Cordes, before dropping rice bot, gives time for those fools down there to let off steam. I don't throw rice bot. Uh oh. Here's a flower, rice bot. I hope you like it. And I'm gonna peg you with a snowball. Well, there's something we do with the freaking snowballs. I don't know what. And it's not in here because we already did the table thing. So, man. I may have to hint. I can't believe on the last level, which is the most difficult, that I would have to use a hint. How sad. How disappointing. I've never used a hint before. So this will have to be the first time in the entire map that I do it. Um, okay, so. Projectiles do not hit snow layers, but they, but the block they cover behind them. Okay. Snow, snow layers, huh? We're looking for snow layers. I feel like if I had seen some snow layers, 
I would have noticed them. But as it turns out, perhaps I didn't. I do just want to throw out there that even if I had noticed the snow, I'm not sure I would have actually thought to throw the snowball at it, even though it's like snow and snow. I'm just not sure I would have done that. The diamond room, lost in loss. What happened here? What happened to all these? Is this the loss meme? Did you try to give her a diamond and she was just like, no, sorry, and kept on walking? That's, that's so sad. Oh, fabric messes with rendering. Usually it only shows through the, I mean, it is. Oh, okay. It's kind of, it's kind of working, kind of a little bit. Hey, um, you know, Here's the thing, since you were going to give it to her anyway, right? I think this is a girl math moment right here, right? You were gonna give it to her anyway. So you were gonna be down one diamond regardless. She didn't take it, her loss to go with the loss meme. And, and so therefore, if I take it, nothing changes for you. This is girl math, let's go. I used a reference correctly. So therefore, if I take this diamond, right? It's all the same. You were down one diamond no matter what. So I'm gonna just go. Cool. All right, heck yeah. Um, yeah, okay. See, we're just rendering through the frames. Nothing else is rendering anywhere else. Nothing else is visible except through the frames. Nothing else. Don't You don't see them on the side there. You just... Anyway. But the whole story is... They say hello. They have dinner. They watch a movie. He's like, will you marry me? And she's like, God, no, we met earlier tonight. What are you doing? And um, that's what happened. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, so now we're married instead. I was like, bro, I got you, bro. All right. Well, we basically did that one without a hint. I mean, let's be honest. So now, um, hmm. What would be, what would be the next? Long Cat, where should we go next, buddy? Wish we could play this. This is so cool, though. Like, it's a tripwire hook, a candle, another candle. Like, what a cool little thing. And a horn and a freaking, oh my God. It's, it's so cool. It's so, I wish we could do things like this without having to do fancy armor stand trickery. Wait, is it that you feed the is it that you feed the shroomy boys flowers? Is that actually what you do? I don't remember. Uh, oh, you can feed them flowers. Oh, then they become a sussy stew maker, right? That's what it is. I forgot, you feed them the flower and then they go sus. Which one do I want though? Can I actually, Is the, do I have other options here? Can I use different ones or have I basically, have I locked him? I locked him into saturation which I'm already being given ample amounts of. <laughs> hmm. Fire is ooh, fire resistance could be good. Could be good. What about this? Blindness probably doesn't help us a great deal. Okay, hold on. Cats favorite place. Drain the thing. Help Red Chef. Frick. I'm like really curious. Oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. If I were to be nudge, yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, you're freaking me up, dude. 
I thought this was going to be a Canadian map moment. Canadian map moment? Why are you standing me up? God dang it. Dang it! Do not go down the chute. What if I want to go down the chute? Don't tell me what I can and cannot do. Yes. Frick. Frick. Hello, long cat. <laughs> Thanks for joining me in here, buddy. Um. Well, as it turns out, I guess there's nothing for me here. <laughs> um, but I think I could, I think I could just hang out here for a little while. Mm. I wanted to, I, I, you know, if rice spot wasn't going to come down, I really wanted to do it myself, but okay. Long cat. Don't go down the chute, buddy. Don't go down the chute. Okay. So what sussy stew do we want? That's the real question. The hint. Okay. I can tell you what the hint is going to be. The hint is going to be, did you know that sussy stew or did you know that if you feed the cow a flower you can get sussy stew that's going to be the hint and i'm going to be like cool i knew that and it's not going to give any details as to where where i'm to use the sussy stew that's going to be the problem okay let me experiment though let me experiment so this was what we got here <laughs> Okay, that's night vision. I feel like that doesn't help us. This is gonna hurt us, right? Yeah, okay, that one hurts us, cool. We like that. Um, would allow us to jump higher though, possibly. And then that is jump, ooh, jump boost might be good. Jump boost could be a good one. Oh, frick, I need to do that again, hold on. I feel like jump boost is uh, potentially, possibly good. Okay, that should be a good amount for the time being. I'm gonna go ahead and just, probably don't need the poppy. Probably don't need to poison myself to death. Um, probably don't need to give myself blindness um so yeah anyway this is uh this is good if i were jump boost where'd it go is it in here it's feel it's probably somewhere else right all right long cat show me where to jump i mean there could be i feel like inside of long cat's room could be a good place to do you know, it's like, uh, will jump boost take me up there? Um, actually, there's not really anything up there, is there? <laughs> Maybe into a painting. Yeah, just try using jump boost at the entrance to every single painting on the wall. Oh, hey, it's a feather. Oh, I can't grab that. <laughs> hmm. Anything under there? Um, for it. Where do I jump, Long Cat? I don't even think the hint book is going to tell me where to jump. I think the hint book is just going to be like, feed flower to m mushroom. I'll be like, God oh, dang it, man. Um, frick. Fricky dicky. Oh. Wait. How many books? That's, uh... That's six books. That's only five books. Dang it. Wait, can I put books in here? I can. What if I matched the pattern? Wait, what are these? What are these books that I just... On reality? What truly existed? I think all are... Oh my god, are these all like... Starting line? Okay, yeah, that's the one that we... That's the one we had ashes oh my god don't make me read all this they all have freaking stuff in them oh they all have stuff i'm just gonna match the books on each side 
Hey, we got Monologue of the Sinner Volume 4. I should keep this one. I never stood up very tall. I think my voice was fairly small, but there were times I'd want to shout through, though my thoughts weren't sorted out. So I'd stumble and I'd fall. I learned to fly because of you. So if you left, I could go too. And everything you saw in me, that's what I wanted to be. Did I make it after all the grass on the other side? Is it only greener in my mind? I still want it the same because trading my life yesterday is to wish my life away. As we dream, as we grow, we we have to learn to let things go, but ne let the wonder never fade. Though we've turned 10,000 pages flying high or stuck below. I've searched for a meaning amidst doubt. I haven't figured that part out. And all the stories inside make me feel like I'm bursting at the seams. And you're here after all. All the grass on the other side is the only greeter in my mind. I still want it the same. Trading my yesterday is to wish my life away. Way. Revenge 4 is sounding sick. Let's go. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's very, very exciting. Um, okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know what to do with all the monologues of the sinners, but but we have them now. If if having the full volumage doesn't doesn't do anything for us, I will be upset. I will be very upset. Can't wait for the album to release. Yeah, 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 for sure, for sure. Okay, notes on the job, scientist log. I hope I'm not freaking things up by just throwing stuff in there. And then this one, hole. They match. Okay, both sides match. Now. You can open sesame. You can open sesame now. It would be pretty cool. Mm, yeah, oh, you're right. Maybe I have to... Now that they're all matching, you will answer the door? No, no, it won't. God dang it, god dang it, god dang it. It's frick and frick and ring ding ding. Nope. What about this one? Oh, this is just normal book. This is just normal book. Wait. Chisel bookshelf instruction manual! <gasps> Why is it 11 pages long? God. Includes uh, electronic warranty, free coupon, slots and use. Bad boys can hold six bookshelves. It's so cool. So you can place and take the cards, intent, redstone compatibility, pre installed, send a signal depending upon the last interacted slot. Yep. Now this new chiseled bookshelf, all tradition, the CEO's added additional feature. The bookshelf will make a click sound after it successfully read the slot interaction, only on ultra shelves. Please wait for the click before attempting another slot interaction. Doing so will mess with the highly complex of the system. Following pages are kind of with you a little better. Just move on with your life. So, okay. I just have to, like, try each one? Ugh. Like, randomly? No click. No. No. Is this what I'm doing? Only on Ultra Edition shelves? Well, which freaking one is an Ultra Edition? And how do I know if it's an Ultra Edition? I don't know if it's Ultra Edition. It makes clicks. But it, but, it, but, it, but it only clicks if I do the right one. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to try every single one. I don't know how long it takes to click though, that's the thing. Oh! That was an ultra edition. But which, but which? It clicked the same each time. 
But if it, it clicks the same time, the same every time, then is it just fill them all? Uh, did I just fill all of them? Ah. What? Sends a signal strength depending upon the last interacted slot. Yeah. I realize this. Bookshelf will make a click sound after it is successfully read the slot interaction. Is it a full-on, like, combination lock? Is there another one? No. Nope. No. We have to find the freaking code somewhere. We have to find the freaking code. Okay, so we know two we know two more things, don't we? Um we know jump boost somewhere and we know a one block by the way, a one block combination lock is is just psycho behavior. Like what? And then we have a mystery thing of some sort. Number of clicks? No, number of clicks. It, it did multiple clicks because I just, like, put multiple things in very quickly. And then it was like, click, 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 click. That's what happened. Um, so, we don't know. We don't know. Uh, freak, freak, freaky dicky. I, no, I can't, I cannot brute force that. There's no way. There's so many possible combinations, it's not even funny. Uh, there's only 24? What do you mean? That depends how many... It depends how many combinations. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. No, that's not it. Like, it could be a... It could be a 10, 10 long combo or something. Can I grab that? Oh, no, I can't. Sure, it's six slots, but it could be like... It could be different combo lengths. It could be a two combo. It could be a four combo. It could be a three combo, six combo. It could be you have to take one out after something like that. I don't know. Um, frick. Oh, that's actually a crazy suggestion. Hold on, that's a crazy suggestion. Wait a minute, wait, 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 wait. That's a crazy suggestion, there's no way. Hold on. If that's true, Maguster, you are actually the world's preeminent genius. You are the world's preeminent genius. Hold up. One, two, three, four... Five. Maguster might have cooked. Three. Two. Wait, why? I clicked again. Oh, I probably... No, no, no. Okay, I probably want to leave the books in. It's just the order in which the books are placed. Okay. Three. Wait for the click. Two. Oh, and that's why there are five books. That's why there are five books. Maguster cooked. Four. Wait. Oh, do you do four again? Like, you take it out. Take it out. And then five. Maguster really cooked hard. Oh my god, he did. Wow. I would not I would not have figured that out. Never, ever. That's crazy. There's no world in which I was gonna figure out the corresponding pages to the freaking It's a good thing that we found the monologues of the center though. Uh-huh. Pretty good thing. Oh, I knew that. I knew there was a secret place behind the fireplace. Like that was just immediately we knew, because it was surrounded by you know fireplace surrounded by the blocks on all sides. We are really we are really going down here. Okay. Did you do a relative TP situation here? You did not. 
You did not. I was like, do I need to walk down backwards? Because I'm starting to feel like I need to walk down backwards. Holy frick, is that the Eiffel Tower? It's the Eiffel Tower along with all the hermits. Huh. Or something like that. Huh. Fascinating. I'm in Paris. Wow. This is wild. Fascinating. God. Is that Minecraft Golden, golden Giga Chad? The Golden Giga Chad is crazy. Oh, Golden Apple. Let's go. Wow, this is so cool. So many options for stuff, man. You seem to be taken aback by the beauty that you are witnessing here. How impressive. I'm most impressed by Golden Giga Chad. That'd be a, that's a really good Minecraft skin, by the way. Someone should, someone should definitely become Golden Giga Chad here. I can't wait to see him in the next uh, time we get on the sub server. Mm. Make sure to like the video and if you want to play things, you know, like maps with your friends, because this one seems like it'd be multiplayer compatible, pretty sure. Uh, I should we should go unstick ourselves. Um, you can use code Captain Sparkles and grab yourself a nice uh, what should we call it? Twenty five percent off your first month. Here, come in, long cat. Via the link in the description, you know. So check it out. Also, code Captain Sparkles at. Uh, Logitech, get you 10% off anything they offer, which is super duper duper. Okay. Two more rooms. And yes, we know one of them is jump boosty and the other is who the frick knows. I mean, I have no idea where the jump boost room is, but that's what we're looking for. We're narrowing things down, right? I think it's either in the kitchen, but it could also not be in the kitchen because we have the cow here. And that could be what this room is for, is just for the cow. Um, it could be like in the main room. We have something just in the, in the foyer. Or it could be somewhere else. Man, I just, wait. Let, let me in, let me in, let me in. Why won't you let me in? What do you mean? What do you mean? No, let, let me in. What else could it possibly be? It's pointing at both of them. It's pointing at both of, oh, it's pointing at both of them. Really? You're going to make, ah, dang. He's making me do a jump boosted, jump boost. A poison boosted jump boost. You are crazy. It was, oh, it even gave me the Lily of the Valley that I needed. The double meaning. The double meaning is is absolutely just the most crazy thing you could have ever done. It's like it it's it's pointing both up like jump up and also ah oh, frick balls. Okay, the bigger issue that we're facing here is like I have to freaking I have to ace this. Oh god, I don't know which which is which. Okay, these are god dang it all sussy stews look the same but they have very different effects. Oh man, if I don't ace this, then we're fricked. 
Okay. Like I go. No, that was not it. Oh no. Oh, let's go, baby. Why the frick have you got this done to me? Why did you do this? What have happened to me? What the frick is that? Why have I? Why am I here? What is this room? What have you done? Oh my God! It's clones in the basement. Holy frick! It's the clones in the basement. Oh man! Uh, my head is also. It don't appear until we get close. Cool, cool, cool. Everything is good. I'm gonna grab that and it caused my head to actually disappear this time around. Long cat, please do not lick the headless clone. Why are you doing this, long cat? Please, please exit the room with me. <laughs> Thank you, long cat. I don't know why you did that. Um, so anyway. Guys. I will merely only end up having to use one more. I'm going to do it. I feel I feel comfortable enough. Wait, which is the one that we haven't gotten? We don't have the nether star. I think I got to do it. When foxes... It's outside. It's outside. It's outside. It's outside. It's outside. It's freaking outside. Alrighty. Fox and socks. Let us go figure out what to do. Okay, buddy. Okay, Sir Flu Fox. Mm -hmm. Why did it disappear? Why is it disappearing? Ah, uh, what the frick is happening? Hold on. I need to. When foxes cannot reach their prey, they will leap to get it. Why, uh, is... Okay. No. Sir Flu Fox! God dang it, I need more eggs now. You've got to be kidding me with this. Long Cat, at least you're more cooperative than the chickens are. Freaking chickens just obliterating themselves upon existence. Gonna need a few more eggies. All of them, in fact. Every single one. There we go. Good amount of eggs. Ready to ready to do it. Okay. I don't know why the chickens do not wish to be existing, but they are not happy about this. Okay. It's not working. Doesn't like that. Oh, there we go. Go! Sir Flu Fox! Sir Flu Fox has gone. What the heck? Is Sir Flu Fox dead? I hope Sir Flu Fox is down here because if Sir Flu Fox is not down here, it's going to. Whoa. Man, you're really treating us with the thumbnails here. I'm just gonna, just gonna throw that out. Really, really treating us to the thumbnails. Good lord, man. Guys, we did it. We did it. Level complete. Twas nothing but the fiction we told ourselves. Wow. Why did we have to... Why did Sir Flu Fox have to be not obliterated? Hey, Long Cat, it's been a good time. I want to leave you with this incredible view. 
of the entire world being tentacled for the rest of eternity. Okay? You survived. You survived as the world was pulled into an abyss by a planet-eating Cthulhu monster, but you made it out. And, um, and that, for that, I'm forever, forever happy. All right? Farewell, long cat. Here is a lot of fish. I hope you don't eat them all in one place. Okay? Farewell, my friend. Nobody knows what comes next. Nobody knows. I love note block music. What a jam. This was very excellent. We are living in a golden age of Minecraft maps. You know? Pretty cool. You've completed Secret Rooms 3. You have earned the right to see some concept art of the map. Enter the broken portal to see it. <laughs> wow. Well, everybody, thank you for tuning in. Make sure to like the video. Subscribe to Captain Sparkles 2. Uh, download all of Brosiest's maps and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> and <laughs> and uh, go to Apex host to use code Captain Sparkles, Logitech use code Captain Sparkles, and all that good stuff. And um, look at the wow! Look at the tentacle monster. Very cool. This is very cool. I recognize these places. They're very nifty. Okay. Well, see you all next time. <laughs>